Hi guys. Okay, our first Dreamweaver video. How exciting. So this short video is just going to be how to insert an image into Dreamweaver and how to center it. Now yes, we're not talking images for a few weeks. This week is simply learning the navigation of the program. But I had a great question in class this last week about centering the image. And although it's getting a little ahead of ourselves, I think it also helps you understand some of the navigational aspects of Dreamweaver. So let's see how we do it. I'm going to just create a new HTML file here. Here's create. Plus it's already, there it goes. Sorry, it's probably lagging because of the video. Okay, beautiful. I'm in split mode, which means I'm seeing my HTML content on the bottom, the code, and then the live um, pane at the top. So beautiful properties at the bottom. Got a couple of my tabs here, insert CSS designer files. And this is all I need in order to insert an image and center it. So this is, by the way, the beginner view for those that were curious and wanted to give this one a try. So I'm going to just click in the box here and I'm going to go to insert image. And I'm going to use one of the images in our lessons one folder that um, was in this week's content on in Canvas. So make sure you download that so you can play around and I'm going to double click on it. Now it's yelling at me because I haven't saved anything. So it's all about paths because it needs to be able to have file structure to work. File structure is very important. So let's go ahead and click OK. But before we do anything, let's go ahead and save so we have that structure. I'm going to go File, Save. I'm going to call this Testing in the Lesson 1 folder. And then in order to apply the styles, centering is a style. I'm going to need a style sheet. So over here, I'm going to click this button that says add a new CSS source. So I'm going to create a new one and I'm going to call this styles. And I'm going to want to make sure it's in the same lessons one folder, which it is. So beautiful styles. If it's not, you're going to have problems. They need to be in the same place. Then save and then OK. So now that we have our styles here, now we can go ahead and center this image. First, I need to assign it to a class group. So I'm going to click this plus sign for add class ID. And I'm going to just call it shopping. You name your own classifications. And as you start to do this, you'll realize short is good, but specific is good too. So shopping is an image of a girl shopping. If I had multiple shopping images, I probably would want to think of something more detailed. But for this exercise, just the word shopping is fine. It wants the source for this style to be applied, and that's my styles.css I just created. And we're doing media queries weeks ahead, so we're going to leave that alone for now. I'm going to hit enter. And so now, if we look at the bottom here, click on this image, then in the properties pane, we will see that it's assigned to class shopping. We just did that. Awesome. So now that we have added the classification to our image, we're going to apply styles to that class. So in our CSS designer here over on the right, we will notice that there's now a class there that wasn't there before. That's dot shopping. So I can go ahead and click on it and then it gives me the option to add properties to that class. Now the first one we're going to want to do if we're wanting to center this is mess with the margins. The left margin would need to be auto. And the right margin, margin dash right, would need to be auto as well. What this is going to do is it's going to automatically put it in the center based on the screen size. So one more thing needs to be done. You're like, well, why isn't it working? And that's because the image element, so I'm talking HTML now, is a block element. So I need to tell it to display as block to apply the rules appropriately. In layman's term for Dreamweaver, all that means to all that means for you is to understand that you need to apply the property display. So hit D and it will give you those options. Select display. And then it will give you all the options for that specific element, which is great. You don't have to have them all memorized. And there's the first one, block. And voila, once I displayed it as block, the image is now centered. So if we go ahead and save this, and then file, preview, and browser. And let's just go and use that Firefox, sure. And then 
save, and voila. So in Dreamweaver, we just inserted an image, and now we centered it. And again, you're just learning how to navigate the program this week. You're going to cover HTML uh, next week as far as just exposure to what it is and how it came about. And then we'll start playing with building a site. So don't feel you need to be able to do this like a pro. Just wanted to show you a quick example of something that can be accomplished in Dreamweaver. That's it for now. Melody signing off.